evening. Welcome to Compline for the Feast of Andrew the Apostle, the 30th and last day of November. We continue our reading of Paulo Coelho's Warrior of the Light, page 113. A warrior sits around the fire with his friend. They spend hours criticizing each other, but they end the night sleeping in the same tent, having forgotten all the insults that were bandied about. Occasionally, a new member joins the group. Because he does not yet share a common history, he shows only his good qualities, and some see in him a master. But the warrior of the light never compares him with his old companions in battle. He makes the stranger welcome, but he will not trust him until he knows his defects, too. A warrior of the light does not go into battle without knowing the limitations of his ally. Almighty God, grant us a quiet night and peace of our lives. Amen. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praise to your name, O Most High, to herald your love in the morning, your truth at the close of the day. Let us confess our sin in the presence of God and of one another. Holy and gracious God, I confess that I have sinned against you this day. Some of my sin I know, the thoughts and words and deeds of which I am ashamed, but some is known only to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I ask forgiveness. Deliver and restore me, that I may rest in peace. By the mercy of God, we are united with Jesus Christ, in whom we are forgiven. We rest now in the peace of Christ and rise in the morning to serve.
Psalm 4. Answer me when I call, O God, defender of my cause. You set me free when I was in distress. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. You mortals, how long will you dishonor my glory? How long we love illusions and seek after lies? Know that the Lord does wonders for the faithful. The Lord will hear me when I call. Tremble then and do not sin. Speak to your heart in silence upon your bed. Offer the appointed sacrifices, and put your trust in the Lord. Many are saying, who will show us any good? Let the light of your face shine upon us, O Lord. You have put gladness in my heart, more than when grain and wine are bound. In peace I will lie down and sleep, for you alone, O Lord, make me rest secure. O God, source of deliverance and help, do not let our hearts be troubled, but fill us with such confidence and joy that we may sleep in your peace and rise in your light. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. A reading from Acts. You will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. You will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. You will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth.
into your hands, O Lord. I come and thy spirit. Into your hands I come and my spirit. You have redeemed me, O Lord God of truth. Into your hands I come and my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands I come and my spirit. Guide us waking, O Lord, and God asleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in now, Lord, you let your servant bow in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Guide us, waking, O Lord, and guard us, sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Hear my prayer, O Lord, listen to my cry, keep me as the apple of your heart. Hide me in the shadow of your wings. In righteousness I shall see you. When I awake, your presence will give me joy. Be present, merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of life may find our rest in you. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Lord, remember us in your kingdom, and teach us to pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Almighty and merciful God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless, preserve, and keep us this night and forevermore. Amen.
peace of christ be with you always